Hey everybody, it is 10 o'clock. We're going to be doing a case of 2017 Leaf Sports Icons Cut Signature Edition. And um, we'll give everybody just a couple minutes to find the video. And we'll get this started. Hey Derek, how's it going? All right, looks like we've picked up several viewers. Um, welcome to Cardboard Treasures. This is 2017 Leaf Sports Icons Cut Signature Edition. And um, this is a full case break, 16 boxes. Each box has one encased cut auto. And um, we are, as you can see here, this is case number 224 of 260. So only 260 cases produced. Um, I've been looking forward to this. Just the sell sheet alone, the uh, big names that are on the sell sheet uh, definitely made me excited about this. We do have one spot left, so if anybody wants to grab it real fast, awesome. If not, um, then we'll take care of that at the end. But um, anyway, let's get this going, guys. It's I know it's late, and this was kind of uh, just kind of popped up. It, we had a lot of unfilled spots, and we had an opportunity to... Uh, get it done tonight so we're not keeping everybody up late on Tuesday I'm sure people are gonna have a lot of work to do when they get back off of Christmas break go back to work so um, real quickly let me uh, switch over to the random screen and I just want to show who has spots in this um, I'm gonna go through it slowly here so four for Kara two for Dave one for Brady one for Allison one for Steve uh, four for Dave one for Brady one for JR and one unfilled spot. So those are the spots that we have right now. Hey Zach, um, it's 65 for a spot and each spot gets one random uh, cut auto out of the product. So I'm gonna uh, take my time pulling these out because these are gonna be encased. I don't wanna bang up any cases or cards in here. So let me uh, take some of these out and set them off to the side. Oh, looks like the last one just filled. Uh, let me verify that. I believe that's the case though. All right, yep, that's it. So uh, last spot is full. Thank you, Dave, I appreciate that. All right. Fun day today. Uh, lots of lots of card stuff today. I was doing some uh, sorting, getting stuff ready for shipment, and then took a trip to the card shop. Did some Bowman's Best. Had some great luck. Saw some other people have some great luck with it. Um, would love to put together a random for that, but it's too late to get one of those filled, I think. Um, then, as I'm sure most of you saw in the post, had some amazing luck uh, with Transcendent. So... Tops, uh, I was skeptical about Tops with their Transcendent, but that turned out to be a, an awesome product. Um, last year's was, I just wasn't sure how they would do this year. So here we go, good luck everybody. So we'll open all the boxes, show all the cards, enter them in on random.org, and then uh, once that's done, we will do the randoms. So good luck, hopefully we get some monsters out of here. I know Derek said he's opened some stuff. Um, got one I probably wouldn't be crazy about and then um, one I thought was pretty cool and then one that he thought was pretty cool uh, that was a, of a golfer so this is multi-sport could be anybody or any anything here and starting us off Bobby Doerr there you go Hall of Famer Major League Baseball that's a nice one that is 12 of 23. Looks like uh, Beckett probably encased these for him. Looking, looking at the uh, slabs. So let me enter that in. Let 
and I am going to put the serial numbers in as well. That's a good start. Bobby Doerr. I told my wife if she hears, hears me uh, screaming and going nuts, then, then we found the Babe Ruth. <laughs> that would be incredible. And another nice one. Bill Russell. Is this a duel? This is a duel. This is Bill Russell and Bob Cousy, 5 of 10. So there's Bill Russell, and on the other side, Bob Cousy. Very nice. That is 5 of 10. Yeah, I, I'm glad that I saw that on the uh, on the label, or I wouldn't have even thought to look on the back of it. Double check. All right. Just wanted to check the Bobby Doerr and make sure I didn't miss anything on that one. awesome both of them for the Celtics and 9 of 13 pro football Hall of Famer Joe Schmidt I wish I had a little something about the players on the back um, I can't honestly say I know who Joe Schmidt is But I'm sure if he's a Hall of Famer, there are people out there that are fans of his. So our next break is going to be the 26th, uh, Bowman's Best Case Number 3. We're also starting to fill a random that will break when, uh, when it's full. <laughs> oh, man. This is awesome. This is 11 of 17. Sandy Koufax. 11 of 17. That is awesome. Wow. Well, I don't know about Joe Schmidt, but I do know that uh, so far we're doing pretty good here. Very nice. We pulled a Sandy Koufax out of uh, Five Star. I think that went to Dave. And uh, we only have seven spots left in our random team uh, Five Star break for New Year's Eve. We're filling a random on uh, New Year's Day. We have one we can break at any time, and then we have another one um, on New Year's Day for Bowman's Best. Oh, cool. All right, this is six of seven. Baseball Hall of Fame umpires, Jocko Conlon and Al Barlick. So a couple of umpires, that's different. And that was numbered six of seven. This is a cool product. I think Leaf does a good job with their uh, with their stuff like this. It's just, man, the delays sometimes are just brutal, especially when you don't find out about them until like a day or two before the product is supposed to release. The only other Leaf product we currently have ordered is uh, Leaf Greatest Hits Baseball, which was pushed back to January 19th. 
And 27 of 27, Carl Hubble. Baseball Hall of Famer, died 1988. I didn't mean to say that with such enthusiasm. So he passed away in 1988, Carl Hubble. And that is 27 of 27. All right, this has been good stuff so far. One of four, Arthur Ashe. That is a cool one. Arthur Ashe, one of four. Tennis legend, uh, passed away in 1993. I remember that. I was in junior high. I don't know. What do you think? Is that our top one so far, or is that going to be the uh, Celtics duel? Yeah, that Arthur Ashe is pretty awesome. So I'm going to be taking a picture uh, here in a little while. I got a I got an awesome package from Kara today uh, with a nice Christmas card. I appreciate that. And um, the Malik Hooker cards I've, that I've been talking about uh, using the same picture. I got a pretty... Uh, pretty awesome package of those today it's gonna to make for a great picture uh, three of four art shell Raiders number 78 Pro Football Hall of Fame three of four art shell I think he was their coach for a while too right the umpires yeah that umpires one was cool I um like I said I don't know about Joe Schmidt I'll have to look him up but so far that's the only one I'm not sure about any other one I uh would be happy to get out of this So last night I was all fired up after the uh Bowman's best break and the optic break and I ended up getting a Bowman's best spot um I tried getting a, uh, <laughs> sorry guys, I got distracted. There's something great coming. Um, I tried getting um, the Cubs spot. I lost out on it. Tried getting the White Sox, and the auction ended too quickly afterwards. And uh, they ended up pulling a Moncada Super Fractor Auto. This is a one-of-one one dual auto. Lloyd Wayner and Robin Roberts, one-of-one one. For the Phillies, that is going to be a nice, nice hit for somebody. Lloyd Wayner, Robin Roberts, one of one. That is awesome. And that was our uh, first box of the second half of the case here. This is box number 10. And three of five. Cardinals, Steve Carlton, and Red Shane Deanst. Of course, I'm biased. This is going to be my favorite one so far. Steve Carlton, Red Shane Deans, three of five. Two Hall of Famers for the Cardinals. I think both of them still live here locally, too.
Yeah, that's especially with both of them having the uh, Hall of Fame pictures. It's a fun product. Then again, Leaf Rookie Retro was too. Like it was, it was hard to uh, hard to sell spots for. But then once we got the spots filled, man, it was a great product. And basketball Hall of Famer, Rick Barry, four of five. Very nice, four of five basketball Hall of Famer, Rick Barry. Yeah, no kidding, Babe Ruth. <laughs> Ruth, Mantle, Pele. That I don't know. That Arthur Ashe. That's that's a huge one. Uh, Gordy Howe, Michael Jordan were also on the sell sheet. Mickey Mantle. A lot of big possibilities. And one of three, this is a dual auto, Charlie Geringer and Bobby Doerr. Dual auto, Hall of Fame second baseman, one of three. That is nice. I keep saying that is nice, but I mean it every time. These are awesome. All right, four boxes to go. Three of three, Hockey Hall of Famer, Alex Del Vecchio. That's awesome. That's got his picture and everything. Looks like the uh, label there's nudged down just a little bit. I'm not sure. Uh, not sure if you guys know any magic tricks to fix that or not. But three of three, Alex Del Vecchio. Three boxes to go. I think we pulled Del Vecchio from uh, Leaf Metal Sports Heroes. All right, Baseball Hall of Famer, 15 of 20, Buck Leonard. 15 of 20, Buck Leonard. I can't tell what exactly he uh, signed here. That is 15 of 20, Buck Leonard, Baseball Hall of Famer. Passed away in 1997. Buck Leonard, he wasn't one of the Black Sox, was he? Stick of gum. <laughs> yeah. Tops chewing gum from the 70s or something. If you ever try to chew any of that Tops gum from the old days, it'll just dissolve in your mouth. A friend told me that. <laughs> I don't know it from experience. All right, 19 of 24, Luke Appling. Baseball Hall of Famer, 19 of 24, died in 1991. And one box to go. Let me uh, get that entered in here. It 
Derek, didn't you get Luke Appling in uh, one of your boxes? Yeah, Luke Appling. All right, last box. Good luck, everybody. You have 22 of 24. <laughs> we got 19 of 24. All right. Let's finish strong here. This is 18 of 25. Gale Sayers. Pro Football Hall of Famer for the Bears. 18 of 25. So this is the only break that we have going tonight. Um, unless, miraculously, we fill a case of Bowman's Best. Uh, there is one random on the website. And it's... Um, Let's see, 27 spots with three combo spots. Okay, 18 of 25. All right. So here we go. Um, let's do a quick recap before we do a random on these. So we had Rick Berry, four of five. Art Shell, three of four. Arthur Ash, one of four. That is an awesome, awesome cut auto. Carl Hubble, 27 of 27. Yeah, I agree, Kara. <laughs> You're right, Larry. <laughs> Dual auto. Uh, Jocko Conlon and Al Barlick. Hall of Fame umpires. That is 6 of 7. 11 of 17, Sandy Koufax. Pro Football Hall of Famer, Joe Schmidt, 9 of 13. Again, that's that's the only one in here that I really couldn't tell you anything about other than what it says there. Uh, 5 of 10, Dual Auto, Bill Russell, and Bob Cousy. 5 of 10, Hall of Famers for the Celtics. 12 of 23, Bobby Doerr. Baseball Hall of Famer. And here's a nice Cardinals duel, three of five. Steve Carlton and Red Shane Deanst. He is wearing a Phillies hat in his Hall of Fame picture there. One of one, Lloyd Wayner and Robin Roberts, Hall of Fame Phillies. Oh, he was, uh, Schmidt was for the Detroit Lions. Here's 18 of 25, Gale Sayers. We gave away a Gale Sayers auto um, in one of our breaks here oh, a few months ago. Luke Appling, 19 of 24, Baseball Hall of Famer. It's got a little scuff going right here. I'm not sure if that'll wipe off or not. Buck Leonard. 15 of 20, Baseball Hall of Famer. Is Buck Leonard, is that the guy John Cusack played in uh, Eight Men Out from the uh, Black Sox? Here's three of three, Alex Del Vecchio. Hockey Hall of Famer. And one of three, Hall of Fame second baseman, Charlie Geringer and Bobby Doerr. That was a nice case. I like that. A lot of cool stuff. Oh, that's not Buck Leonard. All right, here we go with random.org. Uh, let me get the scoreboard out of the way for just a minute. All right, we're going to roll the dice here. Let me make sure I have everything in here that needs to be in here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and 16. All right, we're going to roll the dice. Good luck, everybody. Six times on both. So let's start with the names. 
There's one, two, three, four, five, and six. JR down to Steve. I'm going to pull that scoreboard back up here. Give me just a second. All right, once again, we will randomize six times. Here's our list. Good luck, everybody. One. Two, three, four, five, and six. Arthur Ash on top, down to Bobby Door on bottom. Oh, hang on one second. I tried leaving Bobby Door off of there. So J.R. Gardner, big hit for you. That is awesome. Congrats. Give me a second to get this formatted and we'll go through the hits. All right. Here we go. JR, Arthur Ash, one of four. Congrats, JR. That is awesome. Uh, Dave Watson, nine of 13. Joe Schmidt, Dave Watson, uh, Bill Russell, Bob Cousy, five of 10. Kara, Steve Carlton, Red Shandings, 3 of 5. Dave, Buck Leonard, 15 of 20. And Gail Sayers, 18 of 25. Brady, Paul Wayner, and Robin Roberts, 1 of 1. Congrats, Brady. Uh, Kara, Conlon Barlick, Hall of Fame umpire, 6 of 7. Dave, Carl Hubble, 27 of 27, along with Charlie Geringer and Bobby Doerr, 1 of 3. Kara, Art Shell, 3 of 4. Brady, Rick Berry, 4 of 5. Dave, Alex Del Vecchio, 3 of 3. Allison, Luke Appley, 19 of 24. Kara, Sandy Koufax, 11 of 17. And Steve, Bobby Doerr, 12 of 23. Congrats, everybody. Um, like I said, there was one guy that I wasn't familiar with on there. But um, overall, man, that's that's awesome. That was I, I don't think anybody got a, got a bad hit. Um, but thank you all. I appreciate it. And like I said, uh, we'll be back on Tuesday for Bowman's Best. And... Um, that one we have spots available. I'm, I'm gonna have them on the website um, until Christmas Day, and then they'll go to eBay for one day auctions, whatever's left. I think we have like 19 left right now, and then um, we're also filling a random team of Bowman's Best. Hey, thank you, Brady. I appreciate that. Uh, thanks for joining in. Congrats on your hits. That uh, that one of one's awesome. Um, but yeah, we're filling a Bowman's Best random team along with five star. We only have seven spots left for our New Year's Eve break of five star. Um, so anyway, thank you all. I appreciate it. JR, congrats on that Arthur Ash. That's awesome too. Uh, but thank you all. Have a Merry Christmas. I appreciate you joining in. I appreciate all of the support. This has been an awesome year and I'm very much looking forward to the close of this year and 2018 is going to be even better. So thank you all and I will see you on Tuesday.